What What's is the name? name? Uh, Ban Chan Kui. Ban Chan Choi. Yes. Ban Chan Choi. Say it again. Ban Chan Choi. Ban Chan. Yeah, so right now it's 9 a.m. in the morning. Not a lot of people here, but I'm really surprised. We are in the market that is like, I think it's more, more you can see more of Chinese influence here. So me mean noodles, so they do a lot of um, charcoal styles, like stir fry. I think she tried mm. pulling one over my head. This is imitation, not Birkenstock. No, Birkin shoes. Birkin Birkenstock. Birkin shoe. Birkin shoe. How much is it per pack, can you ask? Maybe that girl. How much? 25. 25. 25. Inside, I think it's wet fish market. Strongly smell the fish. This cat is just loving life. You get the bean makes sprout. Your, makes your nose go like that. No, I feel like it's t it smells delicious. Yeah, definitely. Where is she going to high school? She went from the store. Yeah. The bean sprout. This is my main thing because I'm on the go to lost my way by now. Stir fry. Yeah. How much per piece? 40 cents. I'm told. I got half kilo of bean sprout. Thank you. Yeah. I got 10 fish balls. All of that for seven ranked. That's a huge bag full of stuff. And these are local style wet markets, so you can basically get everything you need. Everything even panties. Yeah, without having to go to uh, like Tesco Lotas, like your traditional grocery store. I was actually concerned before we came here to this wet market about uh, them giving you plastic bags. Because if you go to Tesco Lotas, you have to pay like 20 cents per plastic bag that you get because they're trying to cut down on plastic bags. Hold on, sorry for interruption. We just found like Thai seasoning and actually Jimmy really really love this one. It's called Nam Tok. It's like have like beef, uh, spicy It's my salad. favorite thing in the world in Thailand. You have you haven't you haven't had this one Since for like Thailand. a year. Yeah. So that's why you want it. You can find it, you can find shoe, you can find shirt, you can find bra, panties, snacks, you can find seasoning, you can find everything. Thank you. Thank you. So you. Much. Isn't I give you ten? No, you gave her five. Oh. We actually brought a bag for Taz classes just in case they don't give you bags, but they do offer you bags when you purchase. They have Thailand, they have China, they have Malaysia, they have a whole bunch of different foods, ingredients, recipes, everything you need from all over. So if you are looking for something like that, like I don't even think Tesco Lotus has that specific Nam Tuk seasoning. We went looking for it and they didn't have it. I got legitimately fear of missing out right now because I really want to walk through all the alley here in this market. I was thinking I, I can wander through all, but then it's came, it seems like the more you walk, the more it seems like to appearing more alley, more road. So I was like, oh, I don't know if I can walk through all this. It's like 10 o'clock now, I think, and yeah. at like 2 o'clock, 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock is peak heat. So at about 11 o'clock, you start to get that really, really hot heat, the dry heat. But I'm hoping we can find some iced coffee or something. We can cool down a little bit. What is that? It's going to be hype. Yeah, it is. Ah. Look 
at the way <laughs> look at the way they collect it. It's like it seems like from the cliff. Yeah. And I cannot cash, I cannot read anything on the sign. But I cash one but from say China, so maybe it's mean this one is from China. Tibet. From Tibet? Yeah. People cook this one? Huh? You cook this? Ah, uh, this one you cannot cook that. You can soup in the warm water. Uh, you just soup in the warm water. This one honey, not honey. It's honey? Yeah, this one honey. Can, can I try it. a piece? Yeah. You know, it's good, good for cough. Good for cough? Mm, yeah. For your throat? Yeah. It's still soft and gooey. Yeah. You know, you know this how many years? This one more than 100 years. 100 years old? Yeah, 100 years old. And how much is this? Ah, uh, half kilo, it ring it. One kilo, hundred and fifty. Is it even from honey, dude? People eat this thing. This look like a moss, like um. Probably like what that. they use. Look at how big these bees must have been. These bees must have been huge. It's like a pancake. So we had these in Long Curry, but I wanted to try ev almost everything that we tried in Long Curry. I want to try here just to de determine the difference. To me, but that one, a pambalik in Langkawi is crispy, but this one is soft. This is crispy. No, it look it, it's soft. There's one that's crispy and there's one that's soft. That's okay, thank you. How much is this? One twenty. Okay. Wow, it's still hot. It's very hot. Check it. <laughs> How to call this snack? It is soft. Huh? What What's is the, the name? name? Uh, Banchan Kui. Banchan Toy. Yes. Banchan Toy. Say it again. Banchan Toy. Banchan Toy. Okay. Banchan Toy. How is it? How is it? That kid's paradise. <laughs> so good. Good, good. You like Very it? Very good. You should tell him. Brown sugar and peanut. It's so good. What time does market open? Uh, 6 30 until 11 30. I think, in order to see the process of cooking yeah, and everything, you have early. to come here really early in the morning. But the fact that it's still like very, very hot means that it's somewhat fresh. This is really good. The brown sugar makes it really sweet along with like the pancakes breading. But you can't really taste the crunch of the peanuts. You do taste peanuts, but they grind the peanuts so fine that it's not like overpowering the sugar and the bread, but it's a perfect mixture of bread, sugar, and peanuts. So it's like 10.38 and you can definitely see people starting to pack up. They're like starting to clean up, but I think that's because the market right down the road opens at one. So oh, yeah. they'll probably be done here about 11 give two hours and then maybe some of the people that are here selling will go to that other market to try and sell throughout the day. That's like my favorite so dessert good. I've ever had. If you guys come to Penang, <laughs> if you guys come to Penang and you guys don't come and try Shen Zhou, I will be really mad. Okay, I get the 
Filipina.